go now. Right, I'd like you to meet two very special people, Russ Swift and Victor Bear. Welcome, man. Now, I believe that the both of you have a little challenge between one another. That's right. That's right, yeah. Mm. Right. Now, let me explain what the challenge was. It was a race against the clock between Victor, who's a London taxi driver, and Russ, a stuntman who drives a saloon car. Let's see what they challenged each other to do. Here's a map to explain what it's all about. From the start, they had to go round these six bollards, through five barriers, off and through the chicane, up and around as fast as they could through the next obstacle, then down towards our little garage, stopping before going through the brick wall. <laughs> then they had to get out and head towards the turning circle where they had to do three complete turns and park between two cars, out of there, through the gate to the finish line. Now, hang on a minute. A taxi driver against a stuntman in a family saloon doesn't seem like much of a challenge, Russ. That's right, but I'm going to drive all the obstacles in reverse. Let's see the outcome. Well, here we are then, Francis. Thanks for the lift. Here we are at the start of the race. Now, how are you? What's your confidence like? Well, I'm feeling 100%. I think there's going. To, I think I'm going to win, but I like to say that there's probably only going to be about five, five seconds between me and the loser. And the loser. Yeah. Russell so I'm that, the loser. Russell the loser. I'm very confident. Very confident indeed. You're certainly warmed up for all that traffic, and so's the engine. So I'm going to go over there, blow the horn, and get going. So I, I feel shattered, shattered, <laughs> absolutely shattered I am. You went round very fast. Were there any trouble spots? To be honest with you, the main problem for me was parking between your two cars because that is something a cab driver doesn't really do that often. You don't usually go backwards or sideways or between cars at all. But yeah, that was the most difficult part for me. But hopefully, um, you know, I set a good time for us to beat. Well, it was looking very good. Why don't you just go over there, park up, have a cup of tea, yeah. and I'll go and see how Russell All is. All right, thanks very much. Hiya. Hi. This is Russell in the Rover. Now, what has your Rover got that the black cab hasn't got? Well, it's got a piece of sticky tape over the handbrake button. Uh, and, why? Uh, <laughs> why? So the handbrake doesn't lock on, because uh, I've got to execute all the elements in reverse. So. Uh, I can go forwards between the elements, so I've got to do a few handbrake turns uh, as I approach them to get into reverse, so... Uh, OK, then, well, I'm, I'm going to go over there when I blow the hooter, get going, come back safely. Right, thank you.
Well, congratulations, Victor. You managed to beat Russ by one second. Fantastic. But, Russell, um, that was a really handy parking technique. I'd like to have a look at that again. I'll give you some lessons later. All right. <laughs> oh. Uh, Russell was very handy at parking indeed. Um, we now have a present for you. Francis, bring those gifts on for you. A taxi. Oh, that's very nice of you. Thank you very much. And a rear view mirror. Yeah. <laughs> now we come to our. So, uh, okay then, well, I'm, I'm going to go over there when I blow the hooter, get going, come back safely. Right, thank you. to beat Russ by one second. Fantastic. But Russell, um, that was a really handy parking technique. I'd like to have a look at that again. I'll give you some lessons later. All right. <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh, lovely. Anyway, uh, Russell was very handy at parking indeed. Um, we now have a present for you. Francis, bring those gifts on for you. A taxi. Oh, that's very nice of you. Thank you very much. And a rear view mirror. Yeah. <laughs> now we come to our.
you seem brilliantly. How are you feeling? Oh, I'm so... I'm, I feel shattered. Shattered. <laughs> Absolutely shattered, I am. You went round very fast. Were there any trouble spots? To be honest with you, the main problem for me was parking between your two cars, because that is something a cab driver doesn't really do that often. You don't usually go backwards or sideways or between cars at all, but... Yeah, that was the most difficult part for me, but hopefully, um, you know, I set a good time for us to beat. Well, it was looking very good. Why don't you just go over there, park up, have a cup of tea, yeah. and I'll go and see how Russell All is. All right, thanks very much. Hiya. Hi. This is Russell in the Rover. Now, what has your Rover got that the black cab hasn't got? Well, it's got a piece of sticky tape over the handbrake button. And, uh, why? Why? <laughs> so the handbrake doesn't lock on, because uh, I've got to execute all the elements in reverse, so uh, I can go forwards between the elements, so I've got to do a few handbrake turns uh, as I approach them to get into reverse, so... Uh, OK, then, well, I'm, I'm going to go over there when I blow the hooter, get going, come back safely. Right, thank you. 